All right, here's another quickie. I know I've done this one before, but uh, I just like doing this one. Uh, once you get your brick all carved out and uh, all that stuff, what I do is I paint it, and I do a two-tone and a red brick color, and I, then I wash it with a little bit of orange uh, just to give it a little bit of uh, texture and a little bit of depth. Anyway, um, what you're going to need to whitewash these is some damp paper towels and some dry paper towels, and I use a Kills kills two primer that's the only thing I actually pay for that in my brushes but I will water this down about 40 percent in some water and uh, dilute it and the thing about this is this the, the, the primer is what you call big, big molecule primer uh, as, as opposed to the model paints and the craft paints that are small molecule anyway what that does is basically dries thicker and milkier uh, when you do your your uh, wash so basically you're doing a wash so once you get your bricks painted and it doesn't matter just paint it and what I did is I painted the brick and then I went back around the edges with the the, the lighter color primer but you're gonna whitewash all this anyway but uh, what you're gonna do is generously apply this uh, white primer and make sure it gets in into all the little brick crevices and the thing is you want to make sure that the when you paint the brick, make sure that the, the paint is dry because you don't want pink uh, paint. So basically, whitewash it really well and just, just be real generous because you're going to wipe it off anyway. But you want to get in all those little crevices. And you do this depending on how thick you make it. But uh, anyway, and then bang it off, set this aside get your dry paper towel on there and what you're gonna do is dab you're gonna dab all that extra primer off your uh, brickwork and basically this just gets all the excess you can bang it off and everything but this basically gets all the uh, the uh, cooled up white primer and you can start seeing the brick through there anyway but get all that really well and dab Remember, don't wipe it, dab it. And then take your wet paper towel and do the same thing. And you can wipe this just a little bit, but you wanna do this before the white primer dries. But basically using the wet paper towel is gonna to wipe a lot of the residue. Oops, sorry, hit the, uh, it's gonna, it's gonna wipe all the white foggy residue off your brick and accent your brick but leaving the white mortar and stuff and you like I said don't worry about this but see that's uh, definitely for 30 seconds worth of work and hit it with the hit, hit it with your dryer gun or just let it sit but uh, for 30 seconds worth of work that looks pretty decent and you can go back over it if you want um, it's really up to you but I wouldn't unless you uh, want to discolor it a little bit with some like uh, ochre or some brown color but uh anyway but uh, that's not too bad for 30 seconds worth